Okay, so um, we are here to vlog and record um, the events of today or since last night, right? Since what happened last night. So yeah. I had a really insane, insane day yesterday. I was exhausted, so I went to bed early. And he was a very happy camper yesterday when I, uh, <laughs> I said goodnight. And then um, this morning I woke up and he was not such a happy camper. So I said to Isaac, do you know something that I don't know? And he's like, uh-huh. <laughs> so tell the fair folks exactly what it is that you got last night after I went to bed that caused mm -hmm. you to be not happy. Well, you knew the best was done. <laughs> yes, I did know. Yeah. Yes, I did you knew know that. that. Mm -hmm. But, the, uh, the, he, the bus has been at the mechanics, okay, so. Yeah. But last night I got the bill. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, uh, I was sitting down when I looked at it, but that didn't really help. <laughs> so we didn't, like. I, it was just, I just wasn't, I was not in the right ballpark with what I was imagining yeah. or what I guessed. Uh, silly me for guessing, but. Uh, no, silly yeah. him for not telling the mechanic we only had so much money to spend on it and to give us an estimate <laughs> before we did yeah. it. Didn't, yeah. Was, like, the job was either all or nothing, but yeah, yeah. I, I should have uh, asked for some kind well, of an estimate up front just so I would be, at least we would yeah. be in the right ballpark. But, I mean, we also, I mean, you also went through like a lot of mechanics. It was really hard to find someone. So this was like the only one in the area. Mm -hmm. I mean, you went through how many? Six? Yeah. And I so, wanted somebody good and I, cause I wanted it, this job to be done right. And it, it wasn't shop right. I mean, had you put it, took it to a real shop, it would have been a lot more than that. Yeah, Maybe, I, I, I but well, that's what he said. So it ended up, well, he, yeah. we knew it was going to be 95 an hour for him to work on it. We knew that the, the cost of the injectors were, what, what was about 500, 500. about 500 bucks. Yeah. So, um, on Friday he went there and was helping or watching and getting taught how to put the injectors in and you were what, five hours into it. Yeah. Mm, that video should. <clears throat> I know. Up. Yeah, 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 but I mean, like, at the end of that, I was like, okay, as soon as I heard it was five hours, and I knew we were spending 500 on injectors, I knew we were over a thousand, but um, I didn't think it would go, you know. Yeah. So, so anyway. Yeah. <laughs> so, so I look out my window this morning, I'm working, I get up early to work, I looked out my window, and there's my husband wandering around the street in town, looking like he's just been kicked hard. And super depressed. Yeah, I was, I was a little depressed. It got me down a little. Yeah. I did go for a long. Well, tell them nice what it walk. was. What's the what is the the bill? Twenty two hundred dollars. Yeah. So the bill was twenty two hundred dollars. Yep. Is the bill is <laughs> we haven't paid it yet. Yeah. Plan to pick it up tomorrow. So okay. So here's the thing that I want to record and remember because he's. As you can tell, he's not depressed. He's not down in the dumps anymore. I'm trying. <laughs> <laughs> but, like, I want to record why you're not down in the dumps anymore. Because this lady, this wife of his, gave a little lecture this morning. <laughs> yeah, a little reminder. Which, of stuff that I already knew. And I was right. trying to remind myself last night that... Um, that it's only money and yeah. Papa can provide. He Papa has. as in Yehovah Elohim, in oh, case yeah. you don't know. Yes. And he's taken care of us and provided and, yes, and he, he, has. he will continue to. Yes. And yeah. um, money comes and goes and yeah. in the grand scheme of things, it's not going to make a difference that or that big of a difference, you know? Yeah, because uh, we, we were thinking worst case scenario what 16 yeah i was 14 yeah or so and, and we had we have just thinking 16 yeah and we just sold our explorer the little 
truck that Maggie's been driving. So we were just sold that and we made 17, you made 17 on that. So mm -hmm. I was like, worst case scenario, all of that can go into the bus. And so this is more than that. So we don't have it in one sense, but, um, here's, but I was also like, you know, trying to help us remember that, you know, this is a man who he's an older gentleman. He, he was working out of his own shop and he was working in very cold weather. He was down in very hard positions to work on this. We don't know how to do this. Isaac doesn't know how to do this. And he was stopping to teach Isaac how to do stuff. We have a lot of video and footage from mm -hmm. him and I think that is worth something. Mm -hmm. And he may need the money for something. I mean, he, he we want to be, um, you know, like the scripture says, we want to, you know, pay somebody what they're worth and we, we want to have fair weights and measures idea. Mm -hmm. So we don't want to cheat him out of anything. Absolutely not. We just were a little bit price shocked, sticker shocked. Yeah. And then I, I wasn't there for the rest of the reassembly. Oh yeah. So I, I got a feeling now he may have ran into something that we'll find out about tomorrow, but, and, but you know, he's the professional and yeah. And, uh, I'm not. <laughs> so anyway, I just wanted to record that and just, just so we can remember in the future that number one, it's just money. And number two, we have a creator who loves us and we have so many stories between us and, and this family of how uh, Yehovah Elohim has come through for us in the past. And this is, I mean, he's not going to stop coming through for us. And even if we make a, you know, stupid mistake and don't get an estimate up front, that is, you know, we make stupid mistakes all the time. And that's not the point. The point is, are we going to be people of faith or are we going to forget what our Elohim can do for us when things get hard, when it comes crunch time? So, yeah, you know, my first reaction was, why didn't you get an estimate? So, yeah, I had that first explosion of, <laughs> what? Why didn't we get an estimate? Um, but then it quickly came back to, wait, are we people of faith? And do we trust in our Elohim? And um, and we'll see what he can do. So, in in the end, it's it doesn't matter. And it'll be okay. It'll be all right. And we'll have a, hopefully the bus is not smoking. This is the thing is Isaac is a little nervous to actually ask him over the text. If there's no smoke. If that fixed the smoke issue. So, right? You're a little nervous? Yeah. Well, I asked if it was running good and he said, it starts good and sounds good. <laughs> he didn't mention the smoke. So, <laughs> so I'm, I'm a little nervous, but. We'll, we'll find out tomorrow. So we will have invested more than we thought into this bus for just getting it running and without even starting a conversion on it. <laughs> but I've heard a lot of stories online. I've seen a lot of stories of people with buses that need engine work and then, you know, they end up dumping a ton of money into the engine and things before they even get to the conversion process. And you, just one other thing, you, you said you had a number in your head and that was kind of like having a, you were having issues with that number. Remember? Because we like, cause you saw a video and somebody got a bus for three grand oh, and then. Yeah. You know, when right? we first started on this bus trail, then yeah, there was some story floating around. Somebody said they got their bus for like $3,000 and then yeah. put another five into it and we're, out on the road for eight thousand, and and we're into this one for nine, and it's got a long ways to go before it's even roadworthy to even yeah. start a conversion. And so that that <laughs> number threw me. It just I just had the wrong way wrong. So I just had the wrong idea. I was just in the wrong ballpark as far as the money goes. <laughs> yeah, I, 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 I've seen like, um, you know, buses that are converted, you know, selling for anything from 20 grand to 70 grand to more. I mean, it, so, and those weren't even, those weren't even like classic, those, they weren't classic buses and stuff. So I'm not worried. I know that number one, I know that, you know, I serve a powerful Elohim that can then, that can help us work through issues like this. Um, but also, I also am like, confident in the value of this um bus it's it's uh 
it's a classic <laughs> <laughs> so i think it holds its value but anyway so i just wanted to record that does there anything else we need to say everything's gonna be okay <laughs> yes isaac everything's going to be okay just keep Tell myself that. <laughs> no, you have an Elohim. Remember, we're, we're practicing being people of faith. That was good. Yes. It, it'll be fine. It'll work out. We'll let you know how it works out. Yeah. <laughs>